Hello guys, this is a Retro Gamer 06. How's everyone doing today? Another unboxing video. Yes, you can see by the title of this video, I finally got me a Steam Deck OLED 1 terabyte. It's the highest uh, model for now. Uh, I don't know if they're going to make any more higher up, probably in the future, like a Steam Deck 2 maybe. So yeah, if I get my hand on one of them, uh, but before I get to the unboxing, I want to tell a little uh, story. Uh, it's kind of a nightmare, actually. It was a hassle. So, from the beginning, I try to use a firm. Uh, for those who know what a firm is, it's like an app thing where you can like buy something, you know, that's like over a hundred dollars or two hundred dollars, and you do do a down payment and you choose your like your monthly plan. You know, you get pay it for like six months or 12 months you know save you some money that way you're not spending a full price you know blow your money away and that's what i try to do on steam <clears throat> excuse me so apparently it kept saying error and all that good stuff and i'm like okay what's going on so i come to find out i forgot to check my uh debit card because my other card got hacked into so i i I, I went to the bank, I took care of it, they shut it off, they shredded it, they gave me a new card. So I went in and my new card, tried again, again, error. Uh, I, mean, I can't remember what it said exactly, but it was just like, it was frustrating. I'm like, come on, you know, like, you know, I, I was really, really want me to get me a, a Steam Deck OLED. So... They got me, I think I, I got a refund or something. So if I get the money back this time, I decided to find one on eBay. And I found one. It was slightly used. Only been used once, according to the, uh, to the seller. Uh, so I was able to get it. Again, I used a firm, and it went through. So I was happy. I'm like, yes, I'm finally getting one. Uh, now, this took place. January 1st, okay? New Year's Day, when I got from eBay. Well, three days later, on the 4th, I was checking my eBay status, and then all of a sudden, it said order canceled. And that eBay had given me a refund. And I'm like, okay, what's going on? Like, seriously. So, uh, apparently, the reason was was something with the buyer's address, meaning me, I'm the buyer. So I'm clueless as to what is wrong with my address. They weren't specific with me. Now, <clears throat> one thing I forgot to mention, the night before, okay, uh, January 3rd, me, uh, me, the seller, communicated. He was saying, hey, you know, uh, I put a shipping label. I'm going to ship it out the next day. And I was like, all right, cool, thank you. You know, he was, uh, he or she, I don't know who, I don't know what the seller looks like. Uh, but the seller was saying, you know, I mean, he seemed like a nice person. So we exchanged a few messages saying, you know, thank you. You know, I was saying thank you and everything. And, you know, he said, no problem, you know. So the next day I was at work. Now, this was like maybe toward the end of my shift. Uh, because I do evening shifts, and that's when I noticed that my order got canceled, and I'm like, what, what's going on? That's when I know that it said something to do with my address. Again, they weren't specific, but eBay had refunded my money, uh, so I contacted, I contacted the seller to tell what's going on, never messaged me back. I waited maybe two maybe almost three days, still nothing weird. Now keep in mind, January 3rd, we were talking just fine. So I sent him another text, said, hey, I've been reaching out to you. You know, I'm not upset, I'm just, you know, yeah, I'm a little irritated, but like, what's going on? I wanna, I wanna know what's going on. Still nothing. And as I'm recording this, still nothing from him. So I'm assuming, I mean, it wasn't a stock photo. I mean, it was on his bed. The picture of the Steam Deck was on his bed, so I could tell the real, a real picture, you know, unless he found it on Google. So, my guess, 
is he decided he wanted to keep it. I mean, you could just tell me that, and I would be okay with it. I'd be like, I would be like, you know, okay, whatever. I'll just try again from a, a different seller. No biggie. So, I don't know why he's avoiding me, or she's avoiding me. Again, I don't know the seller or what the seller looks like. So, yeah. So, I'm, I was like irritated. I'm like, my gosh, you know, like, the world does not want me to get a Steam Deck. What's up with that? It's a Bill game device, you know, whatever. So, but I was able to have another credit card, a lot of money on it. So, of course, it was way more than with Steam Deck. So, I just used one of the credit cards. I was trying, I was trying to see my credit card, you know what I mean? I'm trying to save it for emergencies. But I did, I, I did the math, you know, my bills, uh, I'm, I'm pretty good. I'm still my bill. I'm good at paying my bills on time. I'm really good at that. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to use that credit card. And I did. So I bought from I bought from Steam. So this is brand new. So it came to my door today. It came right before I was leaving for work. I'm like, come on. So that's why this is kind of late. Uh, but I might upload this in the, in, in the morning. Not for sure. So, yeah. It's finally here, so enough about my story. It's here. Uh, I think it came in the uh, U.S. UPS. Uh, now, of course, I'm not gonna show the label, but uh, it says Valve Corporation, so I know it's a Steam Deck. I brought my box cutter with me. I. It doesn't seem like it's taped. Well this side but uh i can't show you i'm sorry you hear my cat scratch on the wall uh all right i'm gonna open this up see what it looks like i never held one in my hand so this is the first time so i'll be right back guys all right guys i got it open uh this is what the inside of the box looks like for those who are wondering so get that out of the way <laughs> and then we got this box you can see the valve uh, logo and I believe this is gonna be our charger uh, it looks like it needs another box cutter, so hang tight. And this appears to be uh, a manual, safe health and safety maintenance. It might be just like an agreement, like warranty. It's got like all like different uh, languages. Like y'all can see that. Yeah, it's. Yeah, I think it's like a warranty or something. And here is the charger. Very nice. I never seen a charger like this. And you got the Steam Deck logo. Very nice. And here is the Steam Deck itself. It's already in the case, which is good. Uh, it says it's from Washington. It says Hamburg, Germany. Steam Deck OLED. You can see it. Uh, Right there, OLED. I am very excited to have this. For a while, I didn't really care much for it, but... Yeah, now I want one. The main reason is maybe to help improve my channel so I can play more games. PC games, finally. So, get out of the bag. 
Well, y'all can't see my cat, but she's right there on the table. I have a little side table. Okay, I think the bag is just sealed. You don't need a box cutter for this. Alright. Here it is out of the plastic. And I think you just... Oh, wait, no. If you look, you can peel it. Well, that didn't go so well. There we go. Now, I heard now, I read the reviews that people would get this and it don't work. So I hope mine works. Okay. Wow. In the back. It's got like some kind of strap. I don't know. Maybe this is for the charger. I'm not for sure. But yeah, it's like a little net. It's a, it's a bag. Very cool. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's for like safety, I guess, but I gotta tear this thing off. Alright. I'll be right back once again, guys. Alright, guys. Five got open. I'll be able to use a box cutter. I thought I had to get the scissors, but I did. I do apologize. Y'all can hear the rain. It's raining pretty hard right now. Uh, so I do apologize if my mic catches that. You know what I mean? I can't control the weather, and I really want to do this video because I want to do an epoxy so I can start playing on this thing and figuring it out how to use it. Okay, so this is weird. A little flap. Wow, they really... I like to smell new things. I'm weird. So... They really outdone themselves with this case. I mean, you can see the Steam Deck logo. <sighs> Alright, guys. The moment we've all been waiting for. Or me, I guess, because I've been wanting this for a while. <laughs> Wow. And here it is. Man, that smell. <laughs> okay. Okay. I was kind of getting warm because I thought it said it came with the screen protector. Or maybe this is a claw. No, I think this is a claw. I think I thought it said it, it came with the screen protector. Maybe I'm thinking, maybe I buy that separately. I don't know. Yeah, it's a cloth to clean your screen. But I think you can buy screen protectors because uh, I know I got one on my uh, uh, Switch OLED. So, maybe I'll get one for my Steam Deck. This thing is big. I think it's bigger than my Switch. There's a logo, Val. You got your butts. Oh, wow. They weren't kidding. This thing feels great. I'm afraid to turn it on because I don't want to mess it up right now. So, you got your touch pads. I mean, this thing is just awesome. I think it's R4, R5. 
Okay, it's like the... I guess it's like your hot key or something. Nice. And there's... Like, the volume. Your uh, power button right there. Your headphone jack. Which I think it's right here. This is awesome. And the joystick feels nice. Better than the Switch. I hate to say that, but... Now, I still love the Switch. Y'all know I play the Switch a lot. Because the majority of the games that I play on my channel is the Switch version. So, this is nice. So, I'm going to assume I need to charge this before I start this. I don't know. So, anyway, guys. Thank you for watching. I'm sorry I'm not turning it on. It's late. Like I said, I just got off work. So, um... But this might be uploaded in the morning. I don't know. So, but as, but as I'm recording this, it's night time. So, yeah. Static OLED. This is a one terabyte. This is a, uh, the highest model you can get. So, it better be one terabyte. When I boot this up, I better see one terabyte. Not the, I think it will, will be below that. 525 gigabyte. Which, that's not bad either, so I'm happy with this. Now, for those who are wondering, brand new plus shipping, it's seven hundred and four dollars, so it's steep. But I think it's worth it. So far, I love the look of it. Uh, I'm off tomorrow, so I'm definitely going to be testing this baby out tomorrow. I'm going to do a test drive on this thing. And just have a good time. Maybe I'll do an update video. I don't know. So. But if I if I start doing some PC games on my channel. It'll be on this thing for sure. So. Anyway guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you are new. Leave a like. And don't forget to hit that bell button. So you won't miss a video. Alright guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. For those who did subscribe to my channel, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, that means a lot to me. Uh, I love doing this, doing this content. You know, I've been playing video games since the 90s. I just love doing it on my channel. I never thought in a million years I would play games on the internet, you know, to upload for you guys to watch and have fun. So thank you. Thank you uh, for watching my stuff. I do appreciate it. Share your channel with your family and friends. This is Virgin Gamer 06. Signing out.